This is Why Not Today on KMOT with Stephanie Waldron and Katie Perkins. Welcome back to Mine Up Today. My name is Stephanie Waldruff and with me I have Matt Elmore and Katie Ferkins and today we decided to take the show outside to test out some really cool water guns. Katie, take over. So what we're basically doing is Matt is with Pride Minot and this weekend y'all are doing this huge water gun fight. Talk to us a little bit about it. Yep, so we are going to attempt to break the world record for the largest water gun fight. Uh, so we partnered with RSI Rehab Services Inc. and we're making it a huge fundraiser event for them. Um, so participants can bring a donation, whether it be a piece of non-perishable food item or gently used bedding or a monetary donation to them if, if they choose to do that. Um, so we're asking people to bring some friends and bring their own water guns and we're going to have a great time. And it's going to be right out here at Oak Park. That's mm -hmm. where we are. And so you brought some ones for us to test out. A little bit of everything. I think my favorite is this one. I mean, <laughs> come on now. I like the Small one. but powerful oh, yeah. uh, sort of so <laughs> stephanie and i are going to pick out some guns and we're gonna have our own little mini water gun fight test sort of thing we're gonna test them out and we're gonna try and tell you guys which one is the best so most bang for your buck yeah. yeah so you're ready for this weekend yeah. so i've got the what do we the, call this a pocket pistol? pocket pistol a pocket pistol it's got our uh, our barrel loaded We've got two, a couple of those. Yeah, and our traditional pistol here. Now, talk to us about that thing, because that's... Guy. That's intimidating. A lot, of, a lot of bang for your buck. <laughs> a lot of reload and work time in there. It's but... like a rocket launcher. Oh, yeah. You just get, like, one giant shot out of it, and you're done with it. Yeah, so, yeah, sniper rifle. Awesome. let's see. Do I have water in here? Okay, yeah, I do. All right, so what's our target, Steph? All right, Matt's going to be our Matt target. Forget our the target. tree. Live targets are way more fun anyway. Yeah, so I am think I'm going to need the rocket launcher <laughs> for sure. For sure. All Let's right. Let's see. Let's put you out in front over there, just right there. All right. So first thing, should we try these? Try, try our barrel loaded ones. All right. Ready? Take the stance. Not the face. <laughs> Not the money maker. Kill shot. <laughs> it's got some pretty good range. Good power. All right. Now take a step back. Let's see how far away we can get this. That was what? Two, three yards? I don't know. You're the math girl. <laughs> I did take a lot of math. <laughs> <laughs> All I right. I like this one because we good. still have a lot of water in there. So you can really, you can really like yeah, spend barely, a lot of time I used about shooting that much, people with this like one. Half an inch. <laughs> Shoot our camera guys. <laughs> Alex Coleman and Jordan Vinagrin on cameras. Thanks guys for helping us out. All right, let's try our next ones. I just have the regular pistol here. This, this one. <laughs> mighty but powerful. Maybe. Small but mighty. Small but mighty? That's what we'll call it. Oh yeah, small. So. Small. I feel like I have to like really stretch. Yeah, cause see it's, it's like, like a nice <laughs> mist. <laughs> it's like when you go to Six Flags and they have those like fans with the mist on them. So I you know, don't if only overheat. it were like really hot. That's what they need at the like North Dakota State Fair or something. I'm gonna have to. Let's see this one. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this one's aim isn't very good. Cause that I definitely was not terrible. aiming for his face. <laughs> so aim a little lower. That was just like a squirt, just like. Yeah, I don't know where the water is held in this one either. It still sounds like it has quite a bit of water left in it. This one's my favorite. Do you want to do this one together? We can all do it at the same time. Are you ready? Ready. The rocket launcher. Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so. But now we need to fill it up. As someone who's going to get hit with water guns, as someone who got hit with the water guns, which one do you think was the best? <laughs> I mean, the most effective, <laughs> definitely our water cannon here. Uh, most practical, I'd, I'd say our, our tank loaded. The barrel loaded. one? Yeah. yeah. I, I like this too. This is kind of the more, um, the more common. All right. This is what you think of when you get water guns stuff. All right, well. Here, grab a water gun. So. I guess you should probably get to hit us too since we got to hit him. Yeah, probably. That's only fair, right? So if you're headed out to the uh, Pride Minot Water Gun Festival, get yourself a barrel loaded gun or something or bigger. A cannon. Or a water if you cannon. You really want to make it count. <laughs> and please come out and participate. It's a great cause, great people. It's going to be a lot of fun. We'll be out there. Saturday, sure. May 7th, right here in Oak Park. What time? Registration starts at 11 30. 11 30. Come on out here and have a good time. Thanks for watching Minot Today. Make sure and tune in next time. You never know what we might be up to next. <laughs>